Hello, welcome to my YouTube channel Bookworm. Let us start book summary video. The uses of literacy, aspects of working class life is a sociological Someone study by Richard Hogarth, first published in I 1957. The book focuses on the culture of working class communities in post-war Britain and examines how popular literature, music, and other My forms of media shape their lives and identities. Can't take the Hoggart's central argument is that the working-class culture is distinct from middle-class culture, and that the former is rapidly disappearing as a result of social and economic changes. The book is divided into two parts. The first part examines the nature of working-class culture, while the second part focuses on the changes that are occurring in society. How they are this time, the working class. There's no going home. Hogarth argues that working class culture All is shaped by a number of factors, including family, community, and, and the media. He shows how the working class often relies on popular literature and music as a means of escape from their the daily lives, and how these forms of media help to create a sense of identity and belonging. is that working class culture is a da, 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 part of the to illustrate this point in the popularity of music hall songs among working class communities. He argues that these songs, which often contain body humor and social commentary, were a way for the working class to express themselves and to comment on the world around them. By contrast, He argues that no this is a loss not just for the working class home. themselves, but for society as a whole, which risks becoming increasingly homogenized and atomized. One of the strengths of the book is Hogarth's ability to combine empirical research with personal anecdotes and insights. He draws on his own experiences growing up in a working class family to give the book a sense of authenticity and to connect with his readers on an emotional level. At the same time, he is careful to ground his arguments in sociological theory and to provide a rigorous analysis of the data. However, one weakness of the book is that it is somewhat dated. Reflecting the social and cultural conditions of Britain in the 1950s, while many of the themes in the issues are still relevant today, some of his analysis may seem less relevant or applicable to contemporary society. Overall, the uses of literature is an important and influential work in the field of cultural studies. Provides a rich and nuanced All portrait of working class life and culture, and argues convincingly for the value and importance of preserving this culture in the face of social and economic change. So Thanks for watching. Amazon purchase link in the description. Do check this smile this time. If you like this book review, do like this video and subscribe to this channel.